When your world's on fire, what are you going to do? Sit back and watch it burn? Or do something about it? As a public servant, it's my responsibility to step up and get involved. It's my job. No, I'm not a firefighter. I'm a cop. I just have a knack for being in the wrong place at the right time. You're on that project you've been working on. You said you'd show it to me when we got further along. That was a couple of months ago. Well, if I could just get some quality time to finish it. I mean, with all this equipment here, I could just film it myself. Simon, this stuff is really expensive. I would just need to borrow a video camera set up for a few days. And then I'd be out of this dump for good. Daisy, I'm wasting my time at this job. I need to be out in LA where the action's happening. But Mother, she won't hear of it. She thinks I'm wasting her time and her money. driving me crazy and he was here. I don't know what is happening to you. Conspiracy you're involved in against me, is that it? You need to see someone who can help you get your head back on track. <sighs> get away from me. <laughs> Transformers. The Carrington event is a once in 500 years occurrence. This cloud is on a collision course for Earth. Colossal sized balls of turbulence. Major damage and knocked out power to most part of Ontario. Are we looking at days, hours? Grandpa, what's happening? It'll be alright, sweetie. Everywhere. I can't get a signal either. No AM, no FM, no short wave, no nothing. So what happened? What, what about the power? You haven't looked outside. Not going into town. All hell's breaking loose. And it feels running low. It's the city. Burning. Say we're authorized to use deadly force for our own personal protection. I mean, at least until the military gets things under control.
in December of 1955. Nearly six months after the kidnapping, murder, and subsequent trial revolving around the Negro youth, Emmett Till, and his accused killers, J.W. Milam and Roy Bryant Jr., I sat down with the two men that had been hoisted on the shoulders of white supremacy and later shunned by those same friends and neighbors. I questioned the men. I knew they did it. That answer was brutally obvious. Well, this reporter wanted to understand uh, would Look Magazine paid $4,000 to print and would several million Americans plunk down two bits to read and gossip over is? Why? <laughs>